हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू आई एम एस गेट अकेडमी आई होप एवरी वन इज डूइंग वेल एज ऑल ऑफ यू नो दैट गेट ट्वेंटी फोर एग्जामिनेशन डेट इज ऑलरेडी अनाउंस्ड एंड इफ आई टॉक अबाउट मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग द एग्जामिनेशन डेट इज ऑन थर्ड ऑफ फेबर ऑलमोस्ट लास्ट फिफ्टी डेज आर लेफ्ट एंड लॉट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स आर फेसिंग चैलेंजेस एंड दे हैव लॉट ऑफ डाउट्स सर हाउ टू कंप्लीट द सिलेबस हाउ टू रिवाइज वट एवर वी हैव प्रिपेयर टिल नाउ how to attempt the mock test so there are a lot of things running in their minds so in this particular video i will address all of your doubts here itself and i will tell you how to utilize this last 50 days in a best possible way so that you can get a good score in 24 examination right so let's get started in the video in 24 examination right if you want to have a very good score this last time last 50 days are very crucial okay you have to understand what we need to do and what we don't need to do do's and don'ts should be clear clarity is basically the power here okay please understand this thing now what should be our strategy in this last 50 days okay we have to stick to the basics and what are the basics okay let's get started here the first point we have to allocate the time as per the weightage of the subject that basic blunder mistake every students are doing they will not give the time as per the weightage whatever subject they like the most they will give more time to that particular subject so that should not happen in later part of the video we'll discuss the weightage of the subject as well as the topics in that particular subjects are important we will understand all of this thing because we have to prioritize like which topic we need to give more time which are less important so everything we'll be discussing in this particular video next point as i told you important topics from every subject entire subject is important but from that subject some of the topics will contain more weightage in terms of questions so that we will discuss here so we have to identify so for you i have done some analysis here and i will tell you in every subject which topics are more important so we have to give priority to those topics first right next we have to solve pyq questions and we don't need to do anything extra apart from that focus on the previous year question mark those question in which you find any difficulty or you can assume that this question is difficult for you please mark those questions and again solve those question in the revision time so that approach involved in that particular question should be what clear to you right so pyq we have to focus nothing extra right next thing very important formula sheets so this is the basic and most important thing also you have to create the formula sheet for quick revision you cannot revise entire subject with your class notes we have to prepare formula sheets which will contain important formulas and relations as gate examination will have most of the numericals more than 80 to 85% numericals are there so we need to remember the formulas and the relations so you should not be in a condition that okay i know the concept i know everything but i forget the formula so this thing you should not want in the gate examination so please create formula sheets okay and on a daily basis we have to revise this formula sheets and last but not the least you have to attempt the mock test multiple mock tests you should give so that you will become habitual for sitting for 3 hours i know personally like many students will feel impatient okay sitting for 3 hours is also a big task for them and solving different subject questions also so please sit for 3 hours give mock test it will increase your confidence actually more and more mock test you will give more and more confident you will become so it's all about the confident that you will carry in the examination that will decide how you will perform in the gate examination so these are the five basic points you need to understand so in the last 50 days you need to focus on this five points only now as i told you regarding the priority we need to set as far as the topics and the subjects are concerned okay we'll discuss here but before that you should understand gate cut off is 28.4 in the last 2023 and if i take the average for last 5 uh, years or 10 years you will see approx uh, 30 sometimes more than 30 also sometimes less than 30 if you want to really qualify and this is i'm talking about for third year students so it's not that much difficult that you are assuming it's not that much difficult because if you cover initial 5 to 6 subject top 5 to 6 subjects if you cover you can easily score more than 30 marks 
or you can easily score 40 to 50 very basic point so you will understand from the weightage okay so that cutoff you should remember 30 is basically on an average cutoff for mechanical people will be having now syllabus first mathematics and aptitude so it is already mentioned in the syllabus itself mathematics will be 13 marks aptitude will be for 15 marks together 28 marks out of 100 very huge weightages for this maths and aptitude part next manufacturing science on an average 15 marks sometimes more than 15 also like 16 17 but on an average 15 you will see again very huge weightage out of 100 it is third thermodynamics which includes applied part as well as the basic part together it will have around 10 marks weightage next theory of machine on an average like 9 marks sometimes uh, eight, 10 also sometimes 8 also but this is what the priority you need to set okay first math and aptitude then manufacturing science then thermodynamics then theory of machine then strength of material okay then we have fluid mechanics including this turbo machinery part together you will see 8 marks next industrial engineering 6 marks very important topic then engineering mechanics on an average 6 because uh, recently if you see few years back the syllabus has been added here new syllabus basically in engineering mechanics then heat transfer we are having then finally machine design now based on the priority if you see machine design on the 10th number so should we skip the subject no we have to be very specific and we have to be very selective like which topic i need to select from this machine design okay like if i have the less time only last 50 days are left and you have not touched machine design till now so in our see rather you are skipping whole subject better to select only few topics which have more weightage that is what you need to understand you can't skip entire subject rather you should select some of the topics which are like frequently asked in the gate examination so i will select those topics so that's what we will be discussing in this particular video the topics important in the subject also subject while we will discuss the important topics and that will help you in this last time to prioritize what are the order of the topics that you need to study and where you need to give more time right now starting with the manufacturing part first casting is there solidification time questions they are asking in metal cutting orthogonal cutting is there okay tailor's tool life problems they are asking metal forming rolling problems they are asking then welding is there non-traditional machining is there metrology and inspection is are there so entire one to six are very important topics i have highlighted with a different color so that you can identify these are important one and if you have not prepared powder metallurgy jigsaw fixture you have not prepared and sim part you have not prepared so please skip it just focus on this top six part right because as the weightage is 15 marks we cannot skip entire manufacturing so just focus on this top six part okay now similarly we'll discuss in thermodynamics as well most of the question you will see from first law calculation of heat transfer work transfer enthalpy change internal energy change then we will have entropy now if i talk about the application part like applied thermodynamics part auto diesel cycle vcrs cycle psychometry rankine and britain cycle these are the topics from which you will get the questions so i have highlighted with a different color so that you can easily identify these topics i need to give priority first if you have not studied thermodynamic relation please skip it so if you have studied then it's good but if you have not studied please don't touch this one touch this topics first so that we should set the priority first right now next theory of machine simple mechanism calculation of velocity angular velocity using angular velocity ratio theorem very important i center method relative velocity method gate train questions from epicyclic gate train vibration entire vibration chapter is very important then flywheel and balancing remaining topics are less important so if i have to see like which topic i need to give more time these are the topics in theory of machine subject right next strength of material questions are from the stress strain principal stress strain simple stress strain questions are there then shear force diagram bending moment diagram slope and deflection then torsion so this highlighted parts have more weightage as compared to other topics so if i have to give time i will give more time to this topic first so because as the time is less we have to be very specific in picking the topics from the subject also so that's why i have prepared in such a way that you can understand okay sir these are the topics i will focus on this one first right next fluid mechanics 
कानामेटिक्स एंड डायनामिक्स वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एज मोस्टली क्वेश्चन यू विल सी फ्रॉम दिस कानामेटिक्स एंड डायनामिक्स नेक्स्ट लेमिनार फ्लो थ्रू सर्कुलर पाइप एज वेल एंड फ्लो बिटवीन पार्डल प्लेट्स वन प्लेट इज फिक्स अनदर प्लेट इज मूविंग लाइक दैट नेक्स्ट फ्लो थ्रू पाइप पाइप कॉम्बिनेशन इज देयर पार्डल कॉम्बिनेशन सीरीज कॉम्बिनेशन प्रॉब्लम मेजर लॉसेस माइनर लॉसेस प्रॉब्लम ओके देन बाउंड्री लेयर थ्योरी इन बाउंड्री लेयर थ्योरी बेसिकली द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ वी हैव द बाउंड्री लेयर्स ओके If I talk about the boundary layer theory, specifically displacement thickness we have, momentum thickness, energy thickness. So these thickness calculations they will ask. Now talking about dimensional turbulent flow, turbo machinery, drag and lift, these are less important. So if you have to focus on main things, these are the topics where you need to focus. Right. Next, industrial engineering weightage again six marks, very important. Now in industrial engineering, all of the topics are like important here. But if I have to give more time, I will give time to first linear programming, part CPM problems, inventory control problems. I will first solve. Then remaining, if the time is left, then I will go for these topics. But first priority will be for this top three topics in industrial engineering. Right now, next seventh, engineering mechanics again six marks weightage is there. Truss problems very very important. Friction then. kinematics of particle uh, they will not be asking that much question but the question they will ask from kinematics of particle are very easy but importantly if you see kinematics of rigid body and kinematics of rigid body questions related to i center okay kinematics of particle where newton second law plays a very important role okay de lambert principle is there work energy principle is there impulse momentum equation so these are the concepts that we will be using here and also the principle of conservation of energy these are the topics from which you will see the questions okay next heat transfer now in the heat transfer all four topics are equally important but if i have to see from which topic mostly the question has been asked is the conduction first lot of question has been asked from the conduction then the heat exchanger so till now you have not studied heat uh, this entire heat transfer subject so first give priority to conduction then heat exchanger so we have to give the priority to conduction first here because the questions in the previous year if you see most of the questions are from conduction only in heat transfer subject finally machine design as i told you initially if you want to skip skip the topic not the entire subject this is very basic thing you should understand don't skip entire subject rather skip those topics from the subject which have less importance like springs design of gears okay but you have to give importance to bearing first joints rivet joint bolted joint questions static and dynamic loading questions so you need to give focus to this topics so i hope like you have understood like what are the topics where you need to give more time okay all the subjects we have discussed in detail right and these are the weightage of the subject itself first i will give priority to maths aptitude then manufacturing then thermodynamics theory of machine strength of material like that so you have to allocate time as per the weightage mostly daily on a daily basis if i have to uh, tell you the daily plan you should give daily 2 hours practice for mathematics and aptitude and daily you have to study manufacturing science okay together if you see 15 and 28 you will see and apart from 15 this manufacturing science you will see thermodynamics 10 marks so if i take top 5 subject more than 50 marks weightage is there so please understand we have to cover syllabus in such a way that we will get maximum possible output from the preparation part otherwise if i am preparing one or two subject and let's suppose questions coming from those subjects are really tough and you are not able to solve it then what happens that's why we have to cover the entire subject in such a way that at least you will be able to solve the questions in the gate examination so this thing we are telling for those students who are preparing in the last time only they have they have started the preparation very late actually but the person who has started the preparation in the early like in january february month this year 23 so they have the they have done full preparation so they don't need to worry about anything they have done full preparation they have studied whole syllabus but in the last time where we need to give more focus we have to see the weightage we have to see the importance of the topic and please understand formula sheets plays a very important role in the quick revision just before the examination you will revise the entire subject from the formula sheet very easily and the last thing that i have told you mock test these are very very important thing 
gives as maximum possible whatever mock test number of mock test you can give give okay 3 4 5 please give whatever time is left please invest your time in revision and mock test after mock test analysis you need to do in the analysis what we will do we will understand what are my strength what are my weaknesses on the weakness i will identify these are my weakness i will work on it make sure that weakness will get converted into strength see understand there is a gap between preparation and the performance right we have to decrease this gap okay so how you will decrease the gap when you will understand what are your weakness where actually you are doing wrong what are your mistakes you will understand the mistake from the test only so consider mock test as a feedback mechanism it will tell you okay these are your mistakes you will learn those things every mock test is a learning okay so understand what mistakes you have done then make sure that that mistake should not repeat in the second mock test and that's how you will gradually improve okay so i hope from this video you will get uh, some useful information and from my side all the best to everyone for gate 24 examination thank you so much everyone